Alright guys, welcome to another Parker Plays Life is Strange. Now I'm gonna try to we're gonna get we're gonna continue on the path that we What? We are continuing to play episode five. Polarized. Uh, we had just uh, got captured by the evil Stefano. No, uh, uh let's just jump in. I kinda don't want to spoil stuff, but at the same time, if you've been watching these in order, you have as well. The evil Mr. Jefferson was uh, the killer and killed us and captured us. Didn't kill us. We then went all the way back in time and fixed everything. So that's where we're taking off, taking over now. Uh, so let's see how that goes. Enter scene. Whoa! Pack West, Pacific West. Okay. You're okay, Max. You're safe. On a plane. With Principal Blackwell. I hope I did everything right this time. The independent local teacher arrested Good work, got David. So yeah, we went back in time, warned David Matson about Mr. Jefferson. Holy shit, you rule, Matson. Oh, I'm so proud of oh, you. You're alive. This is just the start of your career. Oh, you're alive. Close your I eyes. I did it. I fixed everything. Okay. Wowzer. Wowzer. so weird to be in between realities. Everything is out of focus and in the distance. Why are we in between realities? Wouldn't we be in just one reality? We're almost in San Francisco. I'm so stressed, but I'm so excited too. Aw, I haven't seen Hot Dog Man in forever. Chloe Hot and I used to totally dog. play the video game and watch him all the time. <laughs> when we were innocent. That's a reference to something else. The beginning of the end for Jefferson and the Prescotts. Blackwell Security uncovers a bunker and scandal. Two Moon Diner amid all the environmental chaos in Arcadia Bay, such as the unseasonal snowfall and beached whales. So those the the whales and the snowfall still occurring, still occurring. Some residents reported seeing two full moons last night. That occurred too. Was when the double moons were clear in the night sky until clouds covered them up shortly after they appeared. No cell phone or video footage was has surfaced yet. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Which has led local meteorologists to believe that imaginations are in overdrive. All right. Acting on a series of tips from David Matson, head of security at Blackwell. Police, of, police officers descended Tuesday on a bizarre underground chamber allegedly used by teacher Mark Jefferson and student Nathan Prescott to drug, kidnap, and photograph young women. Although there were no other signs of physical or sexual assault on the victims, the disturbing revelations have sent shockwaves through the tranquil city of Arcadia Bay. Even Sean Prescott, the most powerful businessman in the area, is under investigation for his role as owner of the farmhouse where the high tech... So they didn't get him for the murder of Rachel? Right? Didn't Rachel, didn't he murder Rachel? Didn't Nathan murder Rachel? Or was that, no, that was before I even got to Arcadia Bay. So Rachel had already been murdered. I guess they couldn't figure that out, which is dumb. They have to assume that she was murdered. And found the picture that we did of her in the, in, okay, so. Why would you mention the murder? It's a admit, little weird. I love being called an artist. The zeitgeist. Please fasten your seat and stow any electronic gear until the plane is on the ground and at the gate. Thank you. We're starting our descent in a few minutes. It's a beautiful day in San Francisco with clear skies and cool 60 degrees. Who's that guy? We hope you enjoyed your trip and we thank you very much for choosing Pacific West Air. Come fly with us anytime. Uh, I don't... 
think so. I'm hoping these airline seats get smaller so I won't have to fly at all anymore. That doesn't make any sense. Principal Wells. Principal Black Wells. <laughs> I'm not being a douche. Uh, we go to Blackwell Academy, right? And then he's Principal Wells of Blackwell. How did you sleep? How did you sleep? Hope I wasn't snoring out loud, Max. Just a bit. Not that I heard. It's he slide, been a tough week right to his face. So I hope you'll forgive me. Between Mr. Jefferson and Prescott's, things have been hectic, to say the least. I totally get it, Principal Wells. That's a smart way of telling me to stop whining. We are proud of you for representing Blackwell at the Everyday Heroes Contest. I know I'm not exactly the guy you wanted in San Francisco, but we all San want you to have a great Francisco. experience here. I already am, and we're not even there. We're not even there. Oh, jeez. Oh, Christ. You gotta stop doing that cocaine. Another nosebleed? Max, you're not just screwing around with time. So just screwing around. Why are we skipping forward now? Is that, I do remember this part. I do remember this part. This is uh, my pictures here at this gallery. What is art? Feast your eyes upon these displays of art and tell me if they are in fact art or just pictures. Everything's art. San Francisco is so cool. And this gallery is huge. So is the buffet. If an event skimps on the food, you know it's a bad event. As long as I don't have to eat any caviar. This is your day, Max. You can do whatever you want. I hope you take advantage of your status and talk to as many influential people here as possible. Well, let's just go work the room. Doctor. I don't know. Let's work the room. I feel so weird, like I'm a little kid hanging with the adults. Let's work the room. After this week, you are certainly not a little kid anymore. In fact, you're a noteworthy adult being honored by your peers. Now you have to start acting like the photographer you want to be. Like a photo. Hell, I want to be in charge of a big school someday. So I started taking charge of things when I was young. <laughs> Ask my poor classmates. Max, I'm gonna eat up that caviar so you don't have to. Uh, better get in there and start schmoozing. You know, I won't always be here to take charge. But you come talk to me whenever you want. Come on, Max. I don't want After everything that's happened, this should be the least scary thing you've ever done. You could always reverse time if you say something awful. Wow, so Max. Back dying. You, there I am. Along with all the other winners. The winners of the Everyday Heroes. I should say... Max Caulfield. instead. Why did I get picked if Mr. Jefferson was the one doing the picking, but then I'm the one that busted? It doesn't make any sense. I guess we had a, 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 a competition without him. Hello, sir. I'm trying to work the room. My name is Max Caulfield. I'm a young photographer who's awesome. Nice to meet you. Moving on. Man. I heard Mark Jefferson was supposed to be here tonight. Not anymore. That was so shocking. I have one of his monographs, too. Hold on to it. His work is going to be worth serious cash. Really? Are you Max Caulfield? Bravo on your entry. I'm the art critic for Iris N Magazine, and we would love to include you in a piece about future trendsetters in photography. photography. I'll send you the details this week, if that's okay. Congratulations Fine. for your piece. Great. Go ahead. Do you have my email? You don't. So are you just bullshitting me? What the fuck? Look Not at it. my style, but the neon is a nice representation. Oh shit! Pretentious alert. 
What? What are you talking about? I don't get it. He's pretending to be something he's not. Pretentious in there. How do these galleries afford to rent here? It's just for a day. Relax. Weirdo. They probably also take a commission off of everything they sell. Sell. <gasps> a dog and a baby. Of course that one. That should not win. That's not art. That's just a cute picture. You know what I'm saying? You don't know what I'm saying. I know what I'm saying. Innocent girl meets military man. Teacher meets reading a book. What? A smile on a cancer patient. Unheard of. Two doctors. What? I'm not doing that. Two doctors saying happy birthday on a birthday cake. A young man giving someone Be money. cool, Max. Smile and Another doctor don't say anything defeated stupid. After flatline. A dog. That is an, enorm an abnormally large head. I wonder if I can buy these everyday heroes pictures. Sorry, I, I don't know your name, but I saw your picture in the gallery brochure, and uh, I just wanted to let you know how cool your entry was. Sorry, I don't know your name, but I saw your picture you don't need in the to gallery yourself. brochure. I, the first time. Uh, I just wanted to let you know how cool your entry was. A fireman was. saving a Dalmatian. Everyone loves dogs. An astronaut's face. A duh, dad and his kid. A mom and his and her baby. That is different. Loving the retro vibe. Whoa, that's my photo. Hi, and there she is to save the day. Hi. You did it, Max. You're a real artist. At least for today. My photo is pretty cool. Oh, God. Cocaine again. That is loud. It's loud for me, too. Chloe! Hey, are you okay? We lost uh, you there for a second. You're, no, I'm it's just, okay. Uh, it's just I, uh... Jet lag. I do cocaine to, to, to make art. We could turn back time. Oh, you left the ringer off, idiot. Oh, damn. Oh, come on. Please answer. Max, holy shit, man, your vision. It's, it's true. You, you saw the tornado. It's coming. What? Oh, no. Chloe, where are you? I'm so fucking scared. I'm Whoa. The beach. I'm Chloe, scared. can you hear me? She's at the beach. Hello? Stuck Hello? in the house. Stuck in oh my god. A whale. The tornado was real. Oh, I didn't fix shit. Chloe will die. Arcadia Bay is going to be destroyed. Have you seen Star Wars? Go to the there beach. has to be a way to stop Slice this. Slice open a whale. For good. Jump in it. When you're twirling around in the tornado in a whale, the stuff that bounces at you will be bouncing on his blubber and flubber and insides. You're protect it's like a protective shield. Perfect. Uh, I'm like a fucking... Uh, no his... fucking way. Chloe can't die again. You're a zeitgeist for her. photography? I'm a zeitgeist for getting out of awful situations. Tornado? Dead whale? Get in the dead whale. Look at these. These... I'm not gonna lie. This is it doesn't seem like art. It just seems like weird photos. Oh, look at your red hair. Ow. Look at this print. The depth of field, the colors. Look at the bulk of shape. 
This was definitely shot with a medium format camera using a Leica 35mm lens. You can definitely find out those details. The story of a photo if you know how to look at all the details of a picture. Oh, this is so interesting, Matthew. I didn't think you knew about this. When I was younger, I did a lot of photography Please, studies. Please, no. I tell you about it, Emma? I, I have to be in Arcadia Bay to help Chloe. Not to here. Do a real paying job. Anyway, it is interesting to be here, and you're lucky to be with me here. I can share all this with you. Uh, Dad? The label says that this is a print from a disposable camera. What are you talking about? Uh, yes, of course. I was meaning a like a disposable She looked camera. right at me. She looked yeah, right yes. at me. Uh, and don't contradict me anyway, bitch. <laughs> Whatever. You were so lucky to be here with me. You were so lucky to be here with me. <gasps> Hot dog man. Hot dog. I like that one. I kind of want to go look at my photo and sometimes talk, mess around people looking at it. Like, I do not understand art. I agree. I agree. Oh my god, two girls kissing. How could oh they god, do that? This photo. It might be the only way to get back. Uh, okay. Is that Victoria? No, it's not Victoria. Should we work the room first in case this doesn't work out? We gotta have our careers ahead of people's lives. Focus on the photo. Why do... Uh, stupid tornado. We gotta ruin everything, tornado. Excuse me, I'd love to ask you a few questions about your work. Sorry, but... We did it! Excuse me, I'd love to ask you a few questions about your work. I would have said, you have all the time in the world to focus on the photo. I would have said, sure. Greg! Ah, oh, oh, what's up? Mess oh, up. Man. How you doing, man? <laughs> Welcome back, Greg. Did you figure out that quote? What is you going on now? It feels like reality is breaking apart. What am I doing to time? You're messing it up. You're messing it up. My previous timeline was so perfect. I'll accept that I need to be in Arcadia Bay, not San Francisco. She's right. I just have to make one simple change so I won't end up in San Francisco. Simple. I haven't figured it out yet. You're covered in sunburns. What happened? Did you go tanning? Did you try? Did you go tanning on a tanning bed for the first time ever? That happened to me. Tear it up. Oh, tear that up. And then I don't go to San Francisco. Sorry, right. San Francisco. Chloe comes first. Got it. Although, that seems more artistic. A, tear, a torn up piece of that. That's gonna win. That's gonna win. That's gonna win every time. You went swimming? Forgot to apply. Reapply. I get sunburned. I, I go swimming, and then when I get to go swimming, I get sunburned. Because we usually go swimming for like two or three hours, and I apply the, the sunscreen when I first get there. And then don't reapply ever. Tends to happen. Yeah, that's what happens for hours. Yep. That goes away. That goes away. What's going on now? Oh, I'm not. So if I don't win the competition, something else goes wrong? Oh, what? Fuck! Whoa, God, watch the language. No. I'm back here again? I thought I fixed everything. What did you say, Max? What? Jefferson should be in jail. How did that Not happen? Here. Jesus. Seven it's like hours. You're back in my class. Holy crap. You're still spacing out. It's probably a good time. It might be cool if you took one of your patented selfies now. The transformation between the old Max and the new Max. Anyway. And wait a second. Did I use that portrait to get out of his grasp before? He burned the diary. Oh my god, there's an ant on me. He burned the diary? Why didn't I pay attention to the photos? Sir, my question, please. Mm, he burned the diary. Got it. Oh, this is, uh, this is a tough, tough choice here. 
each shite and die or fuck you. Hmm. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go with the fuck. Fuck you. Fuck you. Yeah! Good answer. Good Eat answer. Eat a dick. Hey, your nose is bleeding. A lot. Probably gave you too big a dose. Sorry about that, Max. Is that a side effect of dosing? But considering you're about to die, a nosebleed is a first world problem. Okay. Oh. I had to let Victoria Chase go. You let her? Don't be stupid, okay? She's exactly where she deserves to be. I don't know. No. Dead? No. As if you care. Hell? Do I care about Victoria? No, you're right, I don't. Your iris, that dilation like a shudder. The pictures you're taking of me now. Too bad you pissed away your gift. You could have won the contest, but you destroyed your own beautiful photograph. How does he know that? What a waste. He, he burned that his basement. Sorry. I burned all your stuff. I got a little carried away. Fuck. He you burned know, my diary. I'm always. That's why I'm still here. There we go. It's but I don't know if that makes sense time wise, right? Because in the timeline that we went back to, we still ripped at the photo and still knew. So we were like we we caught him before he even caught us. We were still gonna do that. So burning the diary would not even This one doesn't make sense. This one is like a little bit of the Terminator syndrome where it's like, well, if in the first scenario, John Connor never exists to send you back. So what the hell's going on? I don't know. I don't know. It doesn't seem like it's cohesive. Because he gets caught by the cops before we even get to his basement and need to use the diary to get back. Right? David Matson. Especially since you've developed from nerd to hero within a week. There's something weird going on with you. I can reverse time. Let me show you. Whoa. <laughs> Did you see how crazy it is outside? The train is still coming? So the tornado Something comes in weird. any situation? There's that fear. Oh, Max, it's an honor working with you on these final sessions. I hope these images will be appreciated for what they truly capture. The loss of youth. Mm. <laughs> At least, that's the last lecture you'll ever have to hear from me. And I promise you, great. No more nosebleeds. Mr. Jefferson. <laughs> if I had to hear another lecture, I'd kill myself for you. Hi yo! Please. Sorry. <laughs> don't do this. You don't know what's happening. Shh, 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 shh. Quiet. Quiet, Max. <laughs> Beta Max. Please. Don't do this. Please, can I just see one photo of me before this time? Just so I can remember myself from before. Of course, Max. I just wish I hadn't burned all of them. I think I remember this part, right? Matson comes I in, promise. right? Oh shit. This final dose won't hurt. Okay, wait a second. Wait, wait, wait a second. Let me talk. Why don't you just go talk to talk What? <gasps> Here we go. I do remember this part. I do remember this part. Damn. Matson! Oh, aren't you? A, no, David. No. Aren't you an army person? Jesus, David Madsen. He's out cold. Good. I How always hated that fascist fuck. Whoa, Everybody fascist fuck. That's a good one. Right, Max? Okay. Let's try this one last time. Whoop! Can't do it. I guess you could just exist in this moment forever and just keep rewinding it. That's a little bit of hell right there, isn't it? And I promise you. No, no more knows please. please. Wait, shh, hold on. Can I can I please ask you for one last request? Oh you got me, Max. How can I deny that face? Set me free. Turn off the lights and I glow. 
one last picture. This is uh, this is big. I don't remember this. Let's turn off the lights. Turn off the lights, and I glow to the extreme. I rock the mic like a vandal. Light up the stage just like a jumping candle. Play some music. Could he please at least play some music? I remember him being so over I the can music. Drift away. Even at the end, you're still a dreamer, Max. It's a nice trade. I take it back. I take it back. I take it back immediately. I take it back. I take it back. Don't play music. Don't play music. It's awful. I don't want to drift away to this. Uh, Max, shoot him. We're dead. What? No way, Jefferson. No way, Jefferson. And I promise you, no more nosebleeds. Can Wait. I make a request? One last picture. Turn off the lights. That and would you mind turning said. off the lights? The lights work. They make me squint, so I won't look good for the shot. Now, you're thinking like a real photographer. Oh, now we get him. And I don't want your last memory to be bad lighting. What's gonna happen? What the fuck does the lights have to do? I promise. This final dose won't hurt. What? Say what? David, watch out! How? How did you know that? I'm a genius! He clearly didn't... I didn't... Take my advice. <sighs> Jesus. David Madsen. He's out cold. I warned him. I think the lights were wrong. Frog. That frog is wrong. Alright, let's try some water. Uh, excuse me, but... My throat is scratchy. Throat is so scratchy. Can I please have some water? Of course. I don't want you to be uncomfortable when you die. He doesn't rape them, though. That's why he rejected Victoria in the uh, parking lot. He's all about the, 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 the shot and creepy gloves. Oh, I could kick the thing at him, right? I promise. This final dose won't hurt. That stuff's closer to me now, right? What? I don't understand what the lights do. David, watch out! How? How did you know that? <laughs> yes! It's the water. No gun. No balls. Jefferson, it's over. It's you are not over. going to stop me. Watch out, kick the table. Oh, he's dead. David Madsen. Of course. Going to stop me. Press. Do something. Do something. Do the lights again. Going to stop me. Grab that bottle. Throw it at him. Oh, uh oh. Oh, he missed! Sorry, Madsen. You should have stuck to harass me. You think it's the lights? I understand the lights. What? Going to stop me? Grab your gun now! Got it! Oh, Christ! David Dive and Madsen. do one of the action star things. Come on. So I remember this part, but I don't remember what to do. Over. You are not going to stop me! David! Kick that table! Yes, sir! <coughs> yes, sir! <laughs> yes, sir! David Max! Ah! Uh -huh. I Oh, is it the cable to the lights or something? You are not going to stop me! <coughs> yes! <coughs> Got him. We did it. Oh, Grab his Lord. gun. Max. Are you okay? Uh are make you sure he's right? dead. Yeah, make Can sure he's move? dead. 
Don't do, don't yes. do this. Don't do that, bro. Thank you, don't David. Don't do that, bro. Thank you. Don't thank me. You brought me here. Let's wrap up this son of a bitch first. I agree. Why are you holstering it? <gasps> Shoot him in the knees. He won't be going anywhere when he wakes up. a harder time in prison and say you had to do it in self-defense. People, people don't just torture these fuckfaces. Except you are going to prison forever. Or worse. With Mr. a bad Jefferson, limb. Now it's your turn to be captured in a moment. Take a picture. Win the contest. Don't go to San Fran, though. Save Chloe. He burned everything. Including all of my photos. Yeah, that's rough. Warren! Yes! I, I can use that picture he took of us. Okay. Shit! No signal. I don't remember Warren taking a Thanks, picture of Thanks, Mr. Us. Jefferson. But you won't know oh, this anymore. Oh, at the... At the at the dance party? Oh. No. What the hell is this place? I better go outside and call Warren. Oh, I don't want to talk to Dave David Madsen first. Are you okay? Look at this place. It feels like hell. Jefferson was... was going to kill me. Like he did oh, to Victoria gonna, Chase. Say Victoria oh, Chase. Oh, no. I always suspected that son of a bitch. Then why did you let this happen? You kind of suspected everybody. Yes, and this is what I get for wasting all those hours on the Prescotts. I set my sights too wide. Lack of focus. I know the feeling. I, I never did. I should, I should be honest. Nathan I never did suspect Kate Marsh. Mr. Hefferson. I thought so too. And Max, I'll never forgive myself for what happened to Kate. I feel like I helped push her off that roof. You did kind of bully her, but it's not your fault. Kate was bullied up to that roof, but it was still Nathan and Jefferson who put her there. I knew Nathan Prescott was a threat. I just waited too long to neutralize. Did these decisions actually Jefferson matter? Jefferson already this did. Situation is just different. They had some stuff. weird father-son thing going on. Nathan killed Rachel, and Jefferson had to use him as a scapegoat. That pervert was pulling all this shit right under my nose, too. I could have stopped him and Nathan if only... If only what? I wasn't so stupid. No. I agree. I told Principal Wells Nathan had a gun and almost used it. But he didn't want to believe me. I should have been more loud. We all make decisions we regret. I don't think talking louder would have made him... But I have to admit, more. I'm impressed by you. And Chloe. And your investigation. I had all the high-tech toys while you had each other. We're a great we, team. We are a great team. That's we one are. of my problems. Chloe and uh, Max. I'm not good at teamwork. Never was. Good talk, even Dave. service. I can't even imagine what you went through. I'm not gonna make any... Excuses for my behavior. I tried to be a good soldier, but I wasn't so great. I tried you, to be a good father you only tried too, to be good, but not great. When Joyce kicked me out, I had nothing. Well, go apologize. I'm so sorry about that. I didn't want that to happen. I should never have set up those surveillance cams. We kept all those files. I'm going to tell Joyce I was wrong about you. She does love you. It's pretty obvious. I try not to use my service as an excuse, but... But that's exactly what I'm going to do now. It's hard to come home after that's war. exactly what I'm going to do now. Most people don't know or care what it's like. Except Joyce. Except... She gave Joyce. me hope. Joycey Poo. A new life. And you saved mine. Chloe. Is she? She would be proud of you. I just want to see her safe with her mother. Let's wrap it up. And get I promised Joyce I would go see a family counselor. Uh, I'll start by apologizing to Chloe. I don't expect her to call me dad, but maybe she'll stop calling me step douche. Stop being a douche, and you won't get so called that. So where is Chloe? Seriously, just relax. 
You need to relax. I don't know. I'm gonna go find her. Tell the truth? I'm gonna tell the truth. David. Uh, Chloe is... is dead. This isn't happening. It can't... No, oh, God. God. This is the night after that Chloe died. Not Chloe. I mean, not... This is after. Max, are you, are you Please, sure? That. Are you... Yes, I... I saw her. I... I saw a... Jefferson Killer in the junkyard. Last, Last night, yeah. night. Last night? When I was feeling sorry for myself in my hotel room? What would you, I what else would you be doing? that I would protect her and Chloe. How can I face her and explain this? I kind of agree you can't. I never even told Chloe that I... You probably should just move away. God damn it! You killed my wife's child, you sick fucker! And you took away my stepdaughter! My wife's child? Oh, man. David, Sam wait! Oh! Whoa. Self-defense. He was tied up, but he was reaching for something. That sounds like the cops these days. Am I right? Oh, too soon. Max. It is weird, right? How cops I'm sorry. Are suddenly, all of a sudden, shooting everyone? I'm sorry you had to see that. It's bizarre shit. It's like, relax, Kappa. What have I done? All that time I wasted with surveillance. Uh, Chloe. I'm sorry. Joyce. I failed you. My family. We're gonna go back you in time. Didn't fail. So why does that decision matter? You did your best. You hid the truth. Max. You better get outside. You've seen enough of this room. I David. Agree. Thank you for saving me. If he was feeling wait, what made him come here tonight? You know? How did he figure it out? <sighs> you just committed murder. Like you did a thousand times when you were at the war. Why do you care? Uh, that's what I don't get. Sometimes it's like you're so remorseful about killing but a guy who killed your... Right under my nose. Okay, no, he's more sorry that he let it happen. Leave the dark room. <laughs> Should I have gone and talked to him? Well, I'll just go talk to her. Comfort her. Talk to him. Comfort him. Have you guys seen uh, 10 Cloverfield Lane? Freedom. A buddy of mine was watching the stream earlier. He might still be on. Uh, he hated it. I liked it a lot. I thought it was awesome. And he was like, oh, it's horrible. Horrible. Holy shit. This storm is real. I won't spoil it. I need to find one. 10 Cloverfield Lane. Yes! John Goodman was awesome in it. Warren, can you hear me? I like John Goodman. He's from St. Louis. Never mind. Listen, do you have that photo you took last night in the parking lot? Yeah, but why? It wasn't that great a shot. I yes, need it! It is, and I, I want it. Where are you? I'm at the Two Wells Diner. Pretty much trapped in here with Joyce thinks this Armageddon weather. Or Megadon? I'm on my way. Come on, that's crazy. You can barely walk on the sidewalk outside. I can Seriously, do things you you've you never are. seen. That's okay. Me too. But it's not over yet, Warren. So hold on. Hold on for one more day. I know there's pain. Why do we lock ourselves up in these chains? I like my leather coat now. Ooh, that's a nice car. The Prescott. No, is that Heffersons? Mr. Heffersons? Heffersons. 
I remember walking through town when it's all messed up. Is that this? And I'm the one trapped in this fucking radio station. Whoa! Somebody get me the hell out of here now! Now This game God, loves dropping the F-bombs just like me. You have one new message. Message received yesterday at 9 p.m. Max, it's, it's Nathan. I, I just wanted to say I'm sorry. Whoa, big man. I didn't want to hurt Kate or Rachel or, or I didn't want to hurt anybody. I need you just stop being so Everybody psycho. Use me. It's no excuse. Mr. Jefferson is coming for me now. All this shit will be over soon. Oh yeah, Mr. Watch Jefferson. Watch out, Max. Him. He wants to hurt you next. Sorry. This is actually, I guess, I'm digging the song, actually. Just because it fits with the time. The, 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 you have a song that fits with what's going on in the, the cinema. I think it makes the song a lot better, while the song also makes that cinematic part a lot better. It's cohesive. Get out of the way! Is that Justin? What happened to your stash? Good time for a break. So hurry up. I gotta release the bladder. Thanks for tuning in to uh That has been uh, Life is Strange episode five, part two. I did part part one last night. I played for about 40 minutes. So I like I like the 40, 45 minute parts. So uh, we're gonna take a break at 46 minutes. Dead on. Thank you for tuning in, guys. Uh, as always, you can find all my old videos at parkerbarrowyard.com. I will be back in just uh, two shakes of the weasel.